Hi, my name is Sean McGillicuddy. I, I work part-time here at Eastley Farms. Uh, I've been working here for about three months now, uh, just before the winter started. Um, I came here and I'm doing the hay rides. I, can, I have a, another day job. I work here part-time on the weekends during special events, all that, do farm work. Uh, it takes about 30 minutes to go around, give the tour, and my uh, uh, co-worker Mary gives the tour. I was raised in Framingham and I fell in love with this place ever since when I was a kid because I love farming and will do it probably for the rest of my life. Um, my name is Mary. I've worked here part-time at Eastley Farm for the past 15 years. Um, I do have my own farm out in Athol, Massachusetts. Um, we happen to um, raise livestock and as a matter of fact the chickens that you see here and the goats that you see here are from our farm. Okay, so hi folks, I'd like to welcome you to Eastley Farm. Um, I'm not sure, have any of you been here in the past taking our hayride? Yeah, okay. Um, so as you may I have a Bachelor of Science in um, Animal Science with the Animal Industries option. Um, you could either have t taken the pre-veterinary track or you could take the equine science track or at the time I was there they had the animal industries which covered everything from lab animal management to dairy farming um, to poultry farming. Okay. Now this one is actually easy when it's in perspective but when you're looking at it up close a lot of people think it's something different. Anybody want to tell me what they think it might be, young lady with the ice cream? I was a student at the University of Massachusetts in Amherst um, as a pre-vet student, and I had the most incredible professor ever. Her name was Peg McConnell, and when you took any of her classes, it didn't matter what it was, you had a list of requirements. If, even if you took lab animal management, you had to show a, an animal in the livestock classic. You had to try to ride a horse. You had to go sit through a lamb watch. You had to sit through a full watch. You, you, know, you had to do experience. You had to go to the local auction at least once. You had to do all of these things to experience the whole range of opportunity that there, that is in animal science. And I realized I didn't want to be a vet. I wanted to be a farmer. Um, I was, it was like 2 o'clock in the morning, I was covered in manure, I was washing the back ends of some lambs, and I realized that I was happy and that's what I wanted to do. Uh.